before we get into this video please subscribe to my channel click the bell notification button and please like this video as well hey everybody welcome back to my channel as you guys have seen by the title of today's video i'll be showing you what is in my gorgeous makeup bag because i am absolutely obsessed with makeup and i have changed my makeup bag recently because i think for the past three years I've been using the Ted Baker one and it has just become all shabby and like very old and I needed to get an updated one so I did so here it is, it is a beautiful Louis Vuitton it is actually called the Pouch 26 or something it's fake obviously, it's off over but it is so spacious inside and super gorgeous as well but yeah, I am really excited to show you guys what is inside this makeup bag because I love my makeup so much. But before we get into this video, please make sure to leave a thumbs up. I want to get to a like goal of 30 likes on this video, so please like this video if you are watching. Please subscribe and please leave a comment as well because, you know, why not? Make my day and leave a lovely comment on this video. But without further ado, let's get on the video. So as I said before, I do have a Louis Vuitton pouch. 26 makeup bag and this is super spacious for storing all your makeup in I do have quite a lot of makeup in here so in a makeup bag I do need a lot of space in there because a few of my products are quite like big products if you know what I mean Um, so I got this off over for £11.50 I think and it's the best thing I've ever bought because it, I love it so much and it's like bougie as well and love it so first thing which I'll just open it up the interior is like a lovely soft the brownie colour and on there it actually says Louis Vuitton like inside and it also says it on here as well and it's really pretty and I love it so much so firstly in my makeup bag I do have a eyelash box this is a tatty lashes box because like I'm wearing the eyelashes at the minute and the eyelash glue which I love so much you see original white duo lash glue this glue is super good for making your eyelashes stick onto your eyelids obviously and I've been using this glue for a good three or four years now and I'm just obsessed with this glue and the Tatty Lashes are my favourite lash brand so these two are my absolute favourites and it's always handy to have a lash box in your makeup bag to keep your eyelashes safe because on many occasions I've forgot to take a box with me and then I've lost my eyelashes or they've ended up like they're getting broken but I haven't kept them in a box so it's important to keep a box with you because it comes in handy all the time. Then starting off from here, I do have my absolutely gorgeous Too Faced Natural Lust Bronzer. This bronzer I got for my 18th birthday and I've had it for over a year and I still have a lot of product in it. The colour is absolutely gorgeous. It is more of a glowy bronzer because it does have highlighter in it and the bronzer has got a little bit of a shine to it. I love this bronzer so much. The packaging is gorgeous. Too Faced makeup will always be my fave because the packaging is absolutely gorgeous on each and every product of theirs and also it's cruelty free as well and this bronzer has actually been discontinued unfortunately which I'm super sad about because oh because this bronzer is, uh, is my favourite and I've had it for over a year and it's lasted me such a long time but yeah I love it so much and it's just so beautiful and then speaking of Too Faced I have my gorgeous Born This Way foundation in the shade Snow I got this for Christmas and it is the best medium to high coverage foundation ever like it is an oil free foundation so if any of you guys do have oily skin you will need this because my shine on my nose and my forehead never comes through with this foundation anymore it is super easy to blend and the shade is my perfect foundation shade because I am very pale and the shade snow is a very pale shade with pinky undertones because like I do get pinky ready undertones in my skin but yeah this foundation is beautiful the packaging is really good quality and I just love it so much it's a good favourite of mine and then next up in my makeup bag I do have the Revolution Conceal and Hydrate Concealer in C2 so this one is a hydrating concealer and I use this under my eyes, on my nose, on my chin and sometimes a little bit on my forehead if I want to and the coverage on this is absolutely incredible. I've never tried a concealer as good as this my whole entire life. I am aware it is a dupe for the Tarte concealer but it's like a fraction of the price and this one is around £7. This concealer here isn't the original like Revolution ones, it's a, it's a hydrate one which I love for making my under eyes look a lot brighter and a lot more moisturised as well but yeah. 
C2 because I'm super pale and whenever I am wearing fake tan I usually use the shade C4 for my under eyes but yeah this concealer is super good and I love it so much next up I do have a Style London a Vel Vel Velvet Touch Eyeshadow Palette this palette has got a lovely gorgeous warm shade so it's got like some pinks, orange, yellows, some reds and orange and some browns and burgundies I got this in a glossy box subscription and I have been using it for a good few weeks now it's cruelty free it is a mineral base paraben free talc free and it has some uh, vitamin E in it and this one is the devil eyeshadow palette it's super high pigmented as well and blends super easily and like it's really small as well and it's perfect for and it's perfect for fitting in your makeup bag and the colours are like autumnal and wintery which I love and um these two shades here the brown and the orange I just love blending together it makes such a pretty eye look so this is the palette I love using at the minute. The next up I do have a Morphe Clear eyebrow, eyebrow Gel because I love having an eyebrow gel to set my eyebrows in place because I do actually use the Morphe Eyebrow Pomade in the shade Latte and Morphe do some of the best like eyebrow products on the market. Um, I do want to try their eyebrow pencil but at the minute I just have the Pomade and the Eyebrow Gel and these two are a really good combo for making your eyebrows look on point. I do have very hairy eyebrows at the minute because I do need to wax them. I will have to do them eyebrows soon because I know that they are very overgrown and hairy. But yeah. Next up in my makeup bag, I do have a Doll Beauty highlighter, like a diamond. This highlighter I did buy around my birthday and I've only just started using it. This highlighter is absolutely stunning. It's like a whitey kind of like champagne colour. <laughs> That's it. And the packaging is super pretty, it's like a baby pink and gold and this is what I love about Adult Beauty because all their packaging is just pink and pastel and everything and gold. So yeah, I love this highlighter a lot. They're very pigmented, I do have it on today because I just love having a nice little glow on my face and I always wear highlighter. So uh, that is a very good highlighter that I love to use. And next up in my makeup bag I do have another Too Faced product which, which is the Primed and Peachy Primer. So it's obviously a primer and it smells of peach and oh my god this primer like is a matte one as well which is perfect again if you do have oily combination skin I recommend to get this beauty because it does last a long time and smells super good and it keeps your foundation and your makeup on your face all day as well so I recommend that a lot. I do have a brand new one in my drawer which I will be adding in this bag when this is run out. I've got a bit of a sore throat I don't know what's going on. A little bit of Cork Zero to keep my voice going. Then next up in my makeup bag I do have the Revolution Matte Base Powder in P3. This powder is just a dream come true. Like it sets your makeup like really well and I think I've had this for like a good probably year now and it's lasting me so well. I apply this under my eyes and then all around my face and my face is lovely and matte and set and it's not cakey as well and this is around four or five pounds as well so it's a good bargain and Revolution makeup is really good like it's so underrated next up I do have the Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara because this mascara is one of the best ones on the market it makes your lashes literally like full and really big and I love this so much and I think I've had this for a good while but it's just the best concealer that I've concealer the best mascara that I have ever ever used and the packaging is really nice as well super pretty maybe it's Maybelline <laughs> god I'm so weird and then the final few things in my makeup bag I do have my favourite lip combos which is the Morphe lip liner in the shade Crush this is like a, a deep kind of plummy pinky colour and Morphe lip liners if you have never tried them order some online because they're really affordable. I got a few of mine half price for £2 in the sale. A full price I think the four to £6. And they are so creamy. Do not smudge. Really easy to apply as well. And this colour goes perfectly with this NYX lingerie in the shade Lace Detail. I've had this for years. And like I love it so much. I've re-bought it so many times. Because it's just a lovely shade. And the colour is like a lovely pinky shade. It's honestly my favourite a lipstick ever like I just wear it all the time and then to go on top of this I do have a, a soap and glory sexy mother pucker plumping lip gloss in fair enough because it just completes the whole lip look and makes your lips like glossy and plump and just 
perfect how they should be um, and soap and glory uh, lip plumpers are just some of the best on the market as well like they make your lips tingle so much but it's like a lovely feeling on your lips so yeah that is the final thing in my makeup bag but honestly guys I absolutely love this makeup bag it fits everything in perfectly and all the makeup in here I use on a daily basis and I absolutely love this bag as it has a zip on it as well which is perfect for keeping it all in the bag so it won't like fall out and everything but yeah but i really hope that you guys have enjoyed this video if you have make sure to leave a thumbs up comment down below please subscribe to my channel as well and if you want to see more videos like this then please leave a comment down below as well and i'll see you all in my next video bye everybody